Hi, this is Premium Spender Tutorial Part 19 Array Modifier with Empty. In the previous tutorial, I'm talking about like use the empty to manipulate another object, but empty can also work as a function to manipulate some modifier. Array Modifier is an example of this. Now, first of all, I want to create an empty inside the cube, so I just choose the cube and then slap the cursor to be selected, and then I add an empty object. And then I click to the group and then add uh, an array modifier. Now I change the count to 10 and then I uncheck the relative offset both. And down at the bottom, the important thing is to check the object offset. And then on the drop down menu, we choose empty. Now we just tap it to the object mode, we choose the empty and then we try to rotate it. You can see the new duplicate objects rotated around empty origin point. Now I just go to the top view and then I put my 3D cursor in, the, in this place and I want to make it circle and based on this 3D cursor as a center. So I go to the 3D header menu and then I choose the pivot point to 3D cursor. And now I rotate the empty and then you can see I can fill up the circle with the cubes. Now Array Modifier is really good if you want to create something with the uh, same pattern, something in semicircle or circle. And there's one thing you have to remember that, just another reminder that if you rotate your MT on the top field, you rotate the Array Modifier in top field. If you rotate it on front field, you will array your whole bunch of objects on front field as well. So this rule apply when you are modeling an object or put a modifier on an object. Just like the spin function when you're creating a glass that I put in the previous tutorial, you must on the top field to spin the glass or else you won't get a glass, you just get a reshaped object. So um, if you want to move your object or you want to scale it, uh, you don't choose to empty to do it. You can try it, it doesn't do what you expect. But uh, if you want to edit your object, uh, do a little bit rotation or scale it, uh, you just click on the original object and then tap to the edit mode and then you can start edit your object without affecting the circle shape. One last thing to remind you is um, because I'm using 2.71, it doesn't have this problem. But if you um, have problem with using our modifier with the MT as a uh, manipulator, it specifically didn't apply the rotation and scale on the original object. So if you encounter any problem, just try to press Ctrl 8 and apply the rotation and scale before you choose the MT. Then you should fix your problem.